Welcome to my studio, everyone. I'm Jeffrey Vincent Paris, and we are shortly going to go down to my solo show at the historic gas company lofts. But first, a little painting. You rose with the sun, so she could sleep away the day. She did her always like a queen, cause that's a king's way. This, of course, the legendary Leighton Kelly. To know this man is to love this man. One of the most talented individuals I have ever met. There's a spirit in a painting. There is texture in a painting, the size of a painting. When you see it live, it's, uh, it's different. 95% of my paintings have happened here. There's something to be said about being surrounded by this type of energy and this sort of soulful power of the people in these paintings. And I'm very excited about this show because it's downtown and there's a lot of heavy foot traffic in that area and anytime you get your paintings out of the studio is a good day. There's just something so different about seeing the painting live in its truest form and this day of looking at everything online and on our, on our phone screens and just can never, ever, 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 ever get the same experience as you would by seeing a painting live. Uh, my name is Bonnie Trimble. I'm assistant manager here at Gas Company Lofts. And I originally saw Jeff's work at the Edison. Um, he did a charity function there for a friend of mine, and I was enthralled. We've all had a young love that was to be and not to be. He currently has a show here at our space, and the images are just amazing. You have all these warm tones, and you can almost see into the soul of these, of these people, and they stare back at you, which even gives you kind of the feeling that they're staring into your soul. And they each have their own story. So I wanted to uh, create a, uh, just kind of a, a life cycle theme. This corner over here is like the the dark side of the soul where things get um, very introspective and challenging. Then you ultimately come through and see and, and hopefully find light. Goes back to childhood. And along the way you find um, music and love and fun and your higher self, hopefully. This particular painting is, is Seth Walker. He is a poet. My first art book is being published as we speak. Uh, it should be available at the beginning of next year. I've asked certain people that I've painted to write about their experience of being painted and this is what Seth wrote. I would have broken my wingspan to hold that pose. You paint the way Native Americans fought for family before they were whitewashed. I breathed deeply in meditation, stared off into the land where Buddha still lectures. Bury your best portraits in the desert sand so that one day historians can discover them. You will be the Monet of the next millennium. Seth Walker, poet. Yeah.